Hey everyone, Steven here again with another video about how ChatGPT can help you and your business succeed and improve and take over the competition by implementing simple, easy, and agile steps in order to improve yourselves. We've already talked about how ChatGPT can help your business out in the human resources field, through job descriptions, creating marketing programs, how it can help with document translations, or even improve your overall office ergonomic health. But one of the areas that we haven't looked at so far is how ChatGPT can be used to help bring your teams together in order to get past those first stages of forming and storming uh, when you're building and, and developing your team. Real quick, before we get started, make sure you leave a like on the video, comment down below on what other videos you'd like to see us develop around ChatGPT and how it can be used to help improve business in the employment field. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, let's picture this. You're a new employer and you're starting to build out your team. You're trying to figure out how you're going to build your team, who the personality types are, and how y'all are going to become as efficient and effective as possible, as quickly as possible. You want to get past those storming phases where you're not really undersure, understanding how to get along, how to communicate with each other, in order to get to the performing phases where your team is rocking and rolling and go ahead and, and, taking, uh, and, and taking on bigger and bigger challenges. One of the ways in order to help do that is to host team building events. These events can help break down early barriers in order to get your team past the storming phases into the norming and performing phases. So ChatGPT can be a resource for what activities are out there from a team building standpoint. If you don't have a history in developing team building activities or don't have a history facilitating them, they can kind of seem like a different language. Uh, they can seem confusing and they just seem a little bit odd. That's where ChatGPT helps, like putting them in front of you so you can see what the options are in order to pick the best, uh, the best one to help develop your team. The command that we're gonna use today is a very simple command. All it says is list team building activities that I can do with my new employees in the office. So we're going ahead and setting out that we want team building activities and we want it to be in the office. In this scenario, we're sticking to a workforce that is primarily working indoors. And we'll see what ChatGPT comes out in terms of options for us. Right away, ChatGPT goes ahead and starts listing up not just different team building activities and uh, initial, initial activities that you can do with your team, but it also lists out icebreakers and topics for what these activities could be. So it could be icebreaker questions, asking everyone fun questions, two truths and a lie. These are all common icebreakers and team building activities that you've probably seen from time to time. Uh, the ChatGPT helps put them in a way that is better, easier to understand and simpler. Not only does it list you what they are, but it also explains to you how to use them. You can use an office scavenger hunt. If you're moving into a new location and you're trying to get everyone not just to get to know each other, but to figure out where everything is, nothing like an office scavenger hunt in order to break the break the ice. Office trivia. You know, you can bring people in if you have a company with a long-standing history. Bringing those those new teammates in and quizzing them and giving them some information about the company would be absolutely key in helping you develop and facilitate real long-term growth within your company. It also gives you the opportunity for other, other opportunities for developing your team, like role reversals, escape room challenges, blind drawings, lunch and learns. All of these are different opportunities that you can use to help get past those early stages of storming and into the performing phase. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch our video about how ChatGPT can help you in deciding what your early team building activity is going to be in order to get past the storming phase and move into your performing phase. Thank you so much and have a great day.